Hey, this is Steve Mems uh, with a pseudo press box of the Register Guard. We've returned to Austin Stadium for the first time since the spring game. There's some new turf out here, which you may have noticed that you'll see during the season, but it's Saturday Night Live, uh, Oregon's uh, sort of elite high school camp. A lot of 2020, 2021 recruits out here, some of the top in the nation, uh, coming out here for one day, about a two-hour camp that uh, Oregon is organized to bring some guys in the week before Oregon starts uh, fall camp. We've seen uh, Travis Dye and C.J. Verdell are out here working with the running backs. Justin Herbert's out here working with the quarterbacks. If you look right behind me, we've got the running backs. You see number seven, that's not surprisingly Seven McGee, who is the 2021 running back for the Ducks, has committed to Oregon. Also out there, you'll see Trey Benson, one of the running backs who's committed to Oregon for next year. So we've got a 2020 and a 2021, along with a couple of 2019 recruits. Like I say, Dye and Verdell are out there with them. So. Um, we've had Jay Butterfield, one of the quarterbacks, is out there for Oregon, number nine, he's wearing here. Um, we've got a top offensive guard, Bryce Foster, is here. Um, one guy who's not here but kind of made the biggest news of the day is Jonathan Dennis. Uh, he's a 2020 offensive lineman from Florida, announced his commitment right before the start of this. Again, he's not here, we don't think. There are no rosters being handed out, so anybody could technically be here right now. We do not believe. Jonathan Dennis is here, but he was the commitment. So there's a thought there may be a couple more tonight and tomorrow as some of these guys get off the field. They may announce some commitments. Morgan may get a couple more this weekend. I think the guy who's drawn the most attention out here for Oregon, and, and we'll have some video up a little bit later, is Johnny Wilson. Uh, he's number one, about a 6'6 wide receiver, and I would say looking at him, he is at least 6'6. Uh, guy certainly passes the eyeball test, and uh, he's a 2020. So he's one of the guys Oregon's still trying to get into the next recruiting class. And certainly looks like a guy that if they get him, he could uh, be an instant impact guy the way with uh, which is kind of his size and hands we've seen out here. So thanks for tuning in. We're going to uh, have some video up. Chris Peach will have some video up from some of the guys. And uh, I'll have a story up here later on in this afternoon. And uh, we'll kind of try to recap what all we've seen from Saturday Night Live, the third annual Saturday Night Live being run by Mario Cristobal and his staff.